सर यस सर सर यस सर नाने स्टार्ट मार भी ला हाँ यार तुम्हारे लेट मार दब बैठा ना सुमार पार्टिसिपेंट आचे इधर है आई थिंक इधर मुझे आई आई एम गिविंग एडमिट टॉल अंतर करता है इधर नहीं फाइव मिनट लेट मरी सेवेन ओके यस सर यस सर ना नाने स्टार्ट मार भी ला सुशांत हाँ सर जॉइन आता है इधर आम हाँ वेटिंग रूम में लिस्ट इधर अंतर तोड़ता है इधर सुशांत थ्री पार्टिसिपेंट्स एक फोर आई था ओके सो न्यू एडमिट मारता है रे म्यूट अनम्यूट मारे हम्म सो सेशन डिस्टर्ब आ गाला हम्म संजय और इधर आन
Uh, yes, sir. We have our president here also. Shuru Madan Wala, sir. Yes, sir. Uh. Sanjay. Sanjay, sir. Uh, sir, Over to you. Okay. Uh, good evening, everyone. Uh, career guidance, uh, commerce students, uh, commerce career uh, main uh, degree students post graduation matter, but uh, resume prepare uh, interview phase uh, capacity agirbodatwa knowledge ira lad a basis mele itkondu ivattina uh, how to prepare resume and how to uh, face interview bagge uh, national trainer adanta uh, jfm hitesh gira sir uh, namike trainer training kodak bandidare avrige uh, rutpurakavada swagatavannu kortene uh, mattu uh, uh, Over to Shushant. Good evening, everyone. Now it's a time to introduce our today's trainer. I'm very glad to introduce such a great personality. He is a, a transformational life and motivational soft skills coach. His parents are Yashwant Rajgiriya and Krishna Devi Giriya. Apart from being a successful entrepreneur, he is also a guide, a mentor, a role model for many people. He completed Diploma in International Trade from North Melbourne Institute of Trade. He is a co-founder of Profesio Academy and Consultancy. He is a businessman and also co-founder of Maple Tree Architects, Signify Construction, Lakshmi Hardware. He joined JCA Bangalore Garden City in 2014. He was certified as a zone trainer in 2016 and as a national trainer in 2018. Currently serving Zone 14 as Zone Director Nationalism and Internationalism 2020 and IPP at JCA Bangalore Garden City. He's expertised in soft skill training, motivational training, personality development and other many fields. So it's our great honor to learn from him. He's none other than today's trainer, JFM Hitesh Giriya sir. Once again, a heartly welcome to you, sir. Thank you. Thank you for the opportunity. Uh, thank you, Shushant. Uh, over to Hitesh Kira, sir. Uh, thank you, JC Sanjay, sir, uh, for giving me an opportunity today. And uh, thanks, uh, Sushant, for that lovely introduction about me. Uh, friends, uh, today, uh, the session will be more on understanding what kind of a techniques would you want to adopt to get a successful, uh, get employed, or you can say to get successful in your interviews and grow up in your life. Uh, we all want to grow up in our life. So whenever I ask questions, uh, uh, you can unmute yourself, I can answer the question, or else you can just raise a thumb or you can just wave the hand, whatever the screen, if you have a below screen there, the reaction, this kind of a reaction you can provide me so that I can know that you are listening to me. Uh, first, uh, I just wanted to ask everyone, uh, are you comfortable in English? Can people raise a thumb if they are comfortable in English or they can put it in the chat box, yes or no, whatever it is. Thumbs ups are coming, sir. Thumbs up are coming? Yes. Fine friends, uh, I'll be mixing with uh, a little bit of Kannada also so that if anyone doesn't understand, they can stop me so that whoever is part of this total training 
uh, everyone should have get the benefit of this in a bigger way so we'll be ex- sharing the experience also there are few people in the experienced people also over here few people will be there be like uh, they might have gone for interviews many a times they might have gone for first time or second time this might be the future they might be trying for more of interviews so we can share the real life insurance incidents also from any of you so that we can know it is not more of a theoretical or kind of a thing we'll have understand the practical what people faces in the real uh, scenario of the interviews if you have already experience please let us know so that we'll understand in a better way so coming to today's topic uh, resumes and interviews uh how do you feel actually what do you mean by resume can anyone say it on the chat box what do you feel by resume what do you feel by resume can you just put it across to me yeah someone if you can unmute also i can speak not an issue about that let us be more live you can on your switch on your videos also so that uh, it will be more interaction and uh, we'll enjoy the session more yes senthil sir any of you can just put it across your videos if you can comfortable in opening your videos please open your videos if you have a network issues then you can just think on that introducing ourselves to the interviewers fine next uh, mr jc sushant says that it's introducing ourselves nam swantana nam introduce madbeko in front of interviewers then any other you have to be more interactive because the interaction madilla andre will not be able to understand do not hesitate to put anything uh, let it be more funny let it be like anything don't think that people will think about you what they'll think about us first the inhibition what you carry manasal na vetkontivala bere avaru nam bage yen tilkontare daivittu adana tale taleyinda tagidu bidi tilkoli avaru bekar en bekar tilkoli namge en sambandha illa biodata about pallavi pratap says that biodata about ourselves before the interview fine okay present their background skills yes ruchita says it's a document that has been created by a person to present his or her background skills okay so how many of you have gone for interview process if you can if you have gone before please set it uh, please say it in the chat box yes if you have experience before how many of you prepared the resume also ನಿಮ್ಮ ಚಾಟ್ ಬಾಕ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇಂಟ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಆನ್ ಇಟ್ಕೊಳ್ಳಿ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ಅದನ್ನ ನಾನು ತಿಳಿಸ್ತಾ ಇರಿ ಸೊ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಐ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಏಬಲ್ ಟು ಎಂಜಾಯ್ ದ ಸೆಷನ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಮೋರ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಐ ಬಿ ಲರ್ನಿಂಗ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಯು ಗೈಸ್ ರಾಧರ್ ಐ ಬಿ ಮೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಯು ಲರ್ನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಟು ವೇ ಕಾನ್ವರ್ಸೇಷನ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಟು ಲರ್ನ್ ಬೋತ್ ಆಫ್ ದಮ್ ಶುಡ್ ಲರ್ನ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ ನಾವು ಇಬ್ರು ನಾವು ಲರ್ನ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೆ ನಾವು ಮುಂದಕ್ಕೆ ಹೋಗ್ತೀವಿ ಸೊ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ಕಾರಣಕ್ಕೆ ನಾವು ಇಬ್ರು ಇಂಟ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕಾಗಿದೆ ಆ ಕಡೆಯಿಂದ ನನಗೆ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ಸ್ ರಿಪ್ಲೈಸ್ ಅಥವಾ ಕ್ವಶನ್ಸ್ ಬರಬೇಕು ಸೊ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಮಚ್ ಬೆಟರ್ and today the session will go on much better so let's start the session today and uh, the interview process uh, it's marketing yourself basically nimma nammage marketing madbeku yav rithi martira resume mukanta athwa interview inda so today we'll be learn about more on interviews and resumes on this workshop so coming to the presentation what is resume it's a basically it's a ticket to your interview we all purchase ticket to enter train we all purchase ticket to enter flight we all purchase ticket for and cinemas and everything this is a basically a small ticket to enter your interview process if your resume has been selected you will be called for an interview and if you have been selected you will be recruited and you will be the employee of one of the prestigious company and this across globe so namma ticket na nam artha madkobeku so resume ticket chenagidre matra nimge entry sigutte illa andre kashta agibidutte so always try to prepare your resume to the most beautiful and the best extent how to prepare resume and what is the benefit of resume we'll learn now and more on this basis so first and foremost you never get a second chance to prove yourself always try to create a first impression when i say it's a ticket to an interview this is the first chance people will see your resume and will call you so first impression it should be always the best to make yourself more comfortable in this interview process so next is your resume is the one of the your first impression and it is the most important where the potential employer will look into that you will not get a second chance in your life again and again so try and do your best 
on your resumes. Make your good impression. Always try to be the best because if you give the proper information and required information to the resume interviewer, he will be more happy to call you for the interview because that's the first attraction what he gets. Whenever he sees that, oh, so-and-so person, there is something in this person. When the resume is so strong, they want to make you your they want to make their company to grow the basic uh, mindset behind a person for calling for an interview is to see what you can give for the company so that's where your resume makes more important and stands more stronger next As you said all, everyone says that what is resume is the resume is something which says about to enhance yourself. It is more about telling yourself. The first one is a short account where you say about your experience, qualifications and achievements. Nimma experience, nimma qualification, nimma achievements. Na one in the yard page ali bardo. Now as resume present marti wala adhine resume ante vid because it is only giving your own self, matlab giving your marketing yourself to. To the, to the person who wants to take the interview, who calls for the employment. And it's a goal to capture the reader's interest. Friends, believe me, Nimma resume interest and Gidre Matra Votare, Illa Andre, 15 20 seconds, Adanantara, or automatic agi resume siding Madakare. Because no one can enhance or grow to the whole resume for next five to six minutes. If it's only interesting, they will see your resume for longer time. Otherwise, the 20 second is a maximum or 30 second is a maximum where people will lose interest on your. Resume if it is not so attractive. Even a David to maintain my quality, always understand in the digital marketing also. This is not a digital marketing platform, but I'm still want to tell you about this. Digital marketing also, if you put a teaser or a video, a person who can grab the attention of your video is just only two seconds or three seconds. If you cannot impress that person in two or three seconds, your video will not be seen, or your any kind of a promotion will not be seen. Always look into that the best promotion has been done. When you call for anything, uh, when you promote your programs also, on your long level, when you promote your programs at your college level, wherever it is, the attraction should be more than, not more than the two, three minutes where people get two, three seconds, where people get attracted to your own, to your own uh, promotions, what you do. It must have impact and grab attention. Basically, I'm telling you that only, unless and until you don't put a unique thing or unique connections where people, a person who is reading the resume, he should grab his attention and he should be part of that. Any questions, friends? Shall I continue? You can put it in the chat box. Thumb raise where I can understand I can continue. Are you all guys with me? The chat box is still empty. Can I get some from few thumbs ups? Continue, sir. Thank you, Pallavi. So friends, speaking about this resume, uh, it is more important that you understand yourself better first because what you are, the qualities of yours is most important. Unless and until you don't know about your qualities, your qualifications, your experiences, which is the most important thing, you should first love your qualifications. You should first love your experiences because when you hesitate to write, it will not be good. So always try to understand one thing. So friends, it is basically understanding that how to prepare the resume will stand and stand. First understand what employer wants. employer employee or company first or employer yar nimmare interview madta irutho yar nimmare resume nortare avrige yenu bekanta first artha madko artha madabekagirod important before creating a resume understand what kind of a resume you need to prepare because the employers look after something else so what is the first one the employer looks more into what you can do for me the employer looks ki nanagoskara neevu namma company bandaga namma company matte nanakke profit tarbekandre yen madkortira so make your mindset ki what you can do 
to your employer? What you can give to your employer? How can you improve the operations of the offices? How can you improve the office or the operations of the organizations? That is very important. As soon as you call for an interview, you have been selected. What benefit you can give to the company in doing the day-to-day -day operations and creating the, the sales as well as the company to grow on the higher side? Because unless and until you not do not give to try to give to the company, the company will not be interested. You know to take the recruitment. Sir, if you don't have any experience, a question is there, sir, what if you don't have any experience, like just done with studies? Normally, the companies prefer experienced candidates. Uh, Pallavi, you need to look into the job applications, what you get. When the application says very clearly that experience is required for three to five years, you need to apply for that kind of a category where the where experience is not mattered. So you need to choose the right option where you need to get admitted to the right company. So it, it do not have to worry because there are a lot of companies who recruit freshers. The college replacements also happens and few of the things you can create a platform for yourself by understanding where you can work. Look into the nearest part of your city, wherever you stay, which company can accommodate you and give you a better kind of a mileage where you can grow for next one or two years and get green experience because experience is most important. Any of the company will look into their perspective ki nana company ali yaar experience person banda agar nana company grow agat hai. I cannot pay free. I cannot make the person learn at my company. So many companies have that kind of a restrictions. But do not worry, there are many companies who look into for fresh graduates or fresh postgraduates. So be ready. You have a lot of ample opportunities in India and across Bangalore, across Karnataka, you can get anywhere. The opportunities are open. But try to understand first, understand what you can put in the resume. So let's learn what we can do for resume today. So first understand what company requires from you guys. It's how can you prepare, how can you improve your operations to prepare the resume? The next is, uh, can you make me money? Of course, when a company is looking for a profits, so when they recruit you, they look into that key. If you give me kind of a money, so every company has to grow on the monetary basis, which is the most important part of the company or any kind of a business. Save me time. Of course, any operations happens in the offices or any kind of in a businesses, they look into that key, how much you can give the maximum output with the less use time. Because time is the most important constraint. We have only 24 hours and the working hours is just eight to 10 hours in the each different companies. In this eight hours and 10 hours, what productive work you can do so that you can be most important thing. The friends do me, do understand one more thing. If you're looking for a salary of one lakh rupees or five lakh rupees per annum or a 10 lakh package of a per annum or something like two lakhs or 2.5 lakhs, whatever you feel like, believe me friends, the company looks into that. If I pay 2.5 lakh to that person per annum, what he can provide me to grow the company. Is he able to make 15 lakhs of business or is it make, able to make around one crore of business to my company so that I can pay him because the company will balance accordingly. So always they will think to that key, they will be taking from you five times more what they pay. That is where the company runs profitably. So keep my customers happy. Of course, yes, when you are part of the company, your responsibility is to make the customers happy. You have to be loyal to your company first and then automatically. So these are the few things which uh, employers look into this when they try to see your resume and when they call for an interview. So make sure friends, you all must be more confident on this part of uh, place where if you call me for interview also, these are the few things which you have to keep in the mindset where you go for an interview. Your resume must not only show the skills you have, it must demonstrate your success because the company looks into success. If you are successful, the company also will grow successfully. So that is most important. Company is totally dependent on the employees. So where they work, where the employees work successfully, the company also grows successfully because the give and take policy. So when you go to the resume making, how to prepare your resume, you, how can you arrange the different varieties of in the resume, how most resume looks in the following order. If the, basically I'm giving you a simple order where it looks much easily, it might be changed according to the requirement of whatever you feel like. So first one is contact information. 
the most important in your resume is the contact information if you don't give your provide proper contact information the person will not be able to call you or get connected for to call you for the interviews nimma contact information bage neevu sari kotilla andre yavade karanakku company avaru athwa employer nimmage interview bage kari bekagidre avaru nimma information sikkilla andre yav rithi karitare so nimma contact information complete aagi kodbeku eradnedu objective and the career profile nimma objective yav rithi company ge benefit agutte ನಿಮ್ಮ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟಿವ್ ಮತ್ತೆ ಕಂಪನಿ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟಿವ್ ಎರಡು ಮ್ಯಾಚ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಅಂತ ರೆಸ್ಯೂಮೆ ಆ ಕಂಪನಿಗೋಸ್ಕರ ರೆಡಿ ಮಾಡ್ಕೋಬೇಕು ದ ಕರಿಯರ್ ಪ್ರೊಫೈಲ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಯೋರ್ ಕರಿಯರ್ ಪ್ರೊಫೈಲ್ ವಾಟ್ ಲೆವೆಲ್ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಗ್ರೋ ಇನ್ ಯುವರ್ ಲೈಫ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಮರಿ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ಕಿಲ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ಸ್ಕಿಲ್ಸ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಆಸ್ ಯು ಸೆಡ್ ಸಮನ್ ಆಸ್ ಮಿ ದ ಪಲವಿ ಆಸ್ ಮಿ ದಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಎನಿ ಸ್ಕಿಲ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಎನಿ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಅನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೀರಿಯನ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ ಆಪ್ಷನಲ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಪುಟ್ ಅದರ್ವೈಸ್ ವಿ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡು ನಾಟ್ work experience again if you have your work experience put across otherwise wait work experience can be more of i have the skills can be i have learned tally you know tally you know powerpoint you know excel you know microsoft word or you know any kind of languages those are all skills i know kannada english tamil whatever it is you need to put it across next is work experience education what kind of an education you have done are you a 10th standard or a second pew or you are graduate or you are post graduate or any kind of an extra educations you have done to enhance your profile obviously professional affiliate affiliations if you have any kind of things professional affiliations you please put it across so let's go into depth so the first one is the contact information your contact information is the most important part of the resume as i said put it across in a proper way the name address is an optional if you want to put it across you can put it otherwise it can be optional next is state your state which where you stay where a city you stay and zip code the reason behind is the employer also will be looking for a person who is nearby it might be not right ki the person must be wasting i mean he will be using the lot of time on traveling so rather if he is nearby he will be more active and more productive to us so please put your city and state is most important the telephone number most important if you have your linkedin profile most of the professionals today do have the linkedin profile if you don't have create one just like facebook linkedin is also a platform of profit for the professionals so please do make your linkedin profile more attractive that is also where uh, the employer will go to your linkedin profile and see okay, what kind of a person you are what kind of an experience you carry what kind of an background you carry what kind of a network you carry all this is important for you to grow the of course professional affiliations will come to next up then most important thing is your email id and telephone numbers must be important if you have a facebook connections if you are linkedin if you have any other social media platform which is linkedin connected please put it across on the contact information the next is most important is your objective a short statement that includes the job title and what you want from many re- many reasons and the com- consider your position so most important thing is as i said the objective of your to join that company should be very much clear what kind of objective you carry and what kind of a company has an objective the most important has to get similar to that otherwise the company will not be interested to take you into the, this i'll be uh, asking uh, any kind of questions if you have you can please ask me yeah, yeah. you can stop me any time sir please let me know this because uh, unnecessary rushing fast or rushing moving ahead it not be more productive so if you have any questions please let me know ಯಾವುದೇ ಕಾರಣಕ್ಕೂ ಎಂತ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಇದ್ರು ಕೂಡ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ಕೇಳಿ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಅನ್ಲೆಸ್ ಅನ್ ಟಿಲ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ ದ ಕ್ವೆರಿ ಮೈಟ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಯೋರ್ಸ್ ಯು ಮೈಟ್ ಬಿ ಥಿಂಕಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ದ ಕ್ವೆರಿ ಮೈಟ್ ಬಿ ಸೋ ಸಿಲಿ ಐ ಶುಡ್ ಐ ಆಸ್ಕ್ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ಆಸ್ಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಮೈಟ್ ಬಿ ಸಿಲಿ ಫಾರ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಸಿಲಿ ಮೈ ಫಾರ್ ಸಿಲಿ ಫಾರ್ ಅದರ್ಸ್ ಬಟ್ ಮೈಟ್ ಬಿ ಅನ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ಡ್ ಸೊ ಯುವರ್ ಡೌಟ್ಸ್ ಮೈಟ್ ಬಿ ದೌಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಅದರ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಸೊ ಟ್ರೈ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಡೌಟ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಸೊ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ರೋಸೆಸ್ ಇನ್ ಅ ಬಿಗ್ ಅವೇ ಸೊ ಇಫ್ ಎನಿ ಡೌಟ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಮೀ ನೋ i'll just wait for more 5 seconds or 10 seconds and then we'll move to if there no doubts then we'll move ahead okay friends the objective of the com- to join the company is very clear when you apply for a job title you should be knowing what kind of a position you want to take in the company and what kind of a productive thing can you can give for the company where com- people feel interested to recruit you next is the career profile the most important thing what kind of a career you want to aspire a short paragraph or a five or three to five sentences where you give your qualifications that match to the job where you say i am applying for accountant job what will you be putting i know tally the first important thing is i know tally erp 9 
latest one i know uh, inventory management i know a lot of things that, that will help the people to understand you are understanding the accounting department so what kind of a profile you want to carry you want to go for a different kind of a job where you feel that i can do that please connect to that kind of an attachment so that people will feel to make sure that people will feel that uh, they can understand your profile well and they can make you, they can recruit you for the company next friends what we have learned today is objective and the career profile as well as the contact information in the creation of resume the next important thing is your skills your related the strength the key to your uniqueness the key to your uniqueness which is most important that includes uh, your skills your job relevance your seeking your accomplishments your highlights whatever the achievements you have got in your life or towards your growth to your quality please put it across the best practices the best developments any kind of an uh, recognitions in the past where you have worked before please put it across here because this will be great thing i have achieved 10 crore business in past 3 years in that so and so company where the sales and revenue increased to a larger extent and the company stand strong today so this will help the company to understand what kind of a persona you are yav rithi niyu aa company na belisidira ade company na naavu belisabodu anta manasal bandaga automatically these people will feel that yes this is a right person to a job so make sure your skills your accomplishments everything has to come in a proper way Yeah, I can understand all of more them are commerce students, or any of them are different background. Anyone can speak also. Not an issue about it. Please unmute yourself and can speak. You are from commerce background or what? Yeah, BCA, Computer Applications, Hooper. Anybody else? Commerce, okay. so most of them are commerce so let me understand one more thing uh, if you can people tell me about your goals any of you please put it in a chat box uh, navya is from bsc bachelor of Com uh, science okay no problem uh, put it your goals what do you what do you want to aspire but what kind of what of uh, life you want to lead after this college life company secretary okay cs okay so most of them want to do cs anyone from looking for ca or mba or want to become some kind of a different kind of thing entrepreneur superb aditya jc deepak rao cs good mba shubhada shetty mba from which college ma'am to clear competitive exams okay sumangla bhat join navy wow that's cool pallavi wants to join navy anything else friends any kind of a uniqueness i'm getting good uh, kind of a future for yourself you're looking for mba you're looking for cs you want to become an entrepreneur you want to become a businessman you want to become an uh, uh, give time to your nation by becoming a navy officer company secretary ship anyone no wants to become a chartered accountant over here i'm not seeing any names so we have around 28 participants attending this program and apart i feel that uh, five to six will be from the organizer team but the rest of the people must be looking for some kind of a job anyone wants to own their own business want to become a businessman want to run their own company yeah aditya wants to do the run his own company great great friends so we have a different diversified kind of an goals what you people carry but be more specific to your goals when you say you want to become a cs you want to say it clearly what kind of a professional you will be carrying and what kind of a company you will be working in make more things very much clear if you want to become an into enter into a navy you need to say that what kind of a post in the navy you will be holding and what because if you don't have a specific goal if i say i am a doctor i want to become a doctor doctor can be a person ಮನೆ ಪಕ್ಕದಲ್ಲಿ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಇದ್ದಾರೆ ನೋಡಿದ್ರಲ್ಲ ಎಲ್ರು 
have you all seen the uh, normal mbbs uh, doctors who are next to your house 10 rupees 20 rupees 50 rupees 100 rupees cheeti harth kodtarala avaru doctor anta doctor na vaagbeka we want to aspire to become a surgeon i want to become an orthopedic surgeon one of the best surgeon across south india so i can serve to the people as well as i can earn because that is the most important thing if you don't have a specific goal in your mind you will not land up anywhere be specific to what you want to become so when you look into our job applications also be specific is the job application matching to my goal or not i want to become a doctor and i am taking a ca or working in account department or working in a management department will it help me to become a doctor no so understand the diversification of different kind of a fields so look into the same kind of fields where you can aspire what you want to become because the goals cannot be changed until you accomplish that a strong goals is most important thing and if you guys have a confusion in setting your goals how many people you have setting your goals yes janake aur aur guri life na guri nirdhara madli kashta aagta ide how many of you feel difficult to set your goals in your life are you getting confused what kind of a platform you want to go let me know put it in your uh, chat box yes or no so most of them are uh, having their goals that means uh, good specific goal to what you want to grow great uh, so anyone getting confused so friends if you are getting confused a small uh, simple thing you want to do you can do it is how you can do is take a book of uh, take a book on the front page write down what you want to do in your life but let it be 5 15 20 25 30 45 45 whatever you feel like to do in this life okay, i want to achieve this put it across let it be i want to become a best husband let it be i want to become one of the best father let it be i want to become a best businessman let it be i want to become a best anything put it across when you put it across all the 30 things what you want to do check which are the most important or which are more realistic which you can accomplish so if you feel this is not realistic i cannot do that please put it across scratch it on that and look into that which are those you will be coming to 10 look into this now which are the most important thing you need to do now you will be getting 5 and look into 5 which is your heart feels that you should do now automatically automatically you will be getting an idea ki this is my goal of your life this is my the goal of the life which i can enjoy so try to understand the goal of your life will decide what kind of a job you will go what kind of a career you will be choosing your path what kind of career path you will be choosing that is where you will be staying standing strong so when you choose your career properly when you choose your goals properly automatically the resume what you prepare automatically will be getting connected to your own goals so that is uh, please do understand ki when you don't have a goals then 100% is really difficult if i give you a ball i'll just say throw what will you do will you throw the ball but where do you throw it when i say hit that particular aim automatically you hit that aim you have shown you the goal so when you don't have any kind of a goal in your life you will be just thinking the where i where i need to go you will be moving all across but when you have a specific goal in your mind you will be moving and heading towards your goal so coming back to resume so it always try to understand ki what kind of a skills you have what kind of a things you can enhance yourself enhance your ideas enhance your persona as well as help the company to grow will help the help the resume to become more quality and people will get interested in your resume the next is education education is also most important thing list of diplomas degrees certificates school names and cities and everything if you have not completed your graduation please do not write have you completed graduation if the person asks for your certificates it will be really difficult so always when you do have not completed please put it across you have just done two years of a degree whatever it is the truth is always good to explain otherwise it later it will be big problem so list the total semesters completed i have completed six semesters of bcom i have completed four semesters of bcom i have completed my graduation i have completed my post graduation this will help to understand and this will create a value every details you need to put it across in a prescribed manner in a small scripts way so that people can read understand immediately if you have any certificates or anything please put it across in a separate page and keep it across where if it is required you please show them if you don't have any kind of a certificates no issues if you have them put do not punch with the resume 
keep it with you whenever it is asked sir if you have the certificate please the, show me then you can show the certificates list dates of completion if you have recent graduated any dates if you have that recently you have completed a one of the specific program if i say i just completed my national training certificate in in the year 2018 this will add value to me if i say i am doing my nlp course and futurely i will do my nlp practicing courses it will add value to me so please put it across ki any kind of a futuristic or any kind of a goal recently achieved please put it in a prescribed manner so this is a small resume of mr rahul singhal who is looking for a job job opportunity where he has given brief description about himself on the starting with the overall experience what he have with the work experiences where where he worked what kind of an achievements he have done his life in his works before and what he can give to the company as put it on the right hand side his education as well as his personal details a small crisp two page resume is more than enough do not increase more than two pages you can just have a look into that if you want you can read it understand how many years of experience in the industry you have you can say if you have if you don't have put it across ki i have just started my career into this kind of a field friends do you all feel that uh, when you fill the resume uh, how many of you feel the salary should be mentioned in this what kind of a salary you expect would you like to mention in this should we mention s yes or no no okay jaisi deepak rao says no no okay ruchita says no navya says no sumangla jay says no everyone says no but my dear friends i think you should mention your aditya wants to say something pallavi asks why not yes that's the question what i'm looking for why not why shouldn't you mention can any of you who have said no can unmute yourself and just tell us ki why you should not mention your salaries what we expect let me know friends any of you can unmute you and yourself and can just speak or you raise your hand i'll unmute you sir i'll unmute you guys Sushan said no. Navya said no. Please let me know why. Why you don't? You can speak in any language: Kannada, Telugu, Tamil, whatever language you're comfortable. Let me know. Or you want to put it in the chat box? Please put it in the chat box. so friends when you put your resume in a crisp and beautiful manner please do put your expected salary you want to look for a 10k you want to look for a 20k or look for a 25k what experience you carry you know very well about that when you put it across the employer keeps his mindset the expectation of that person is so and so never have a kind of a two kind of a mind ke mere ko if i get 10000 is fine if i get 15000 is fine no make sure you want 10 or 15 be cleared in your mindset because the employer also should understand ki what kind of a person he is if you if he sees if he sees a look at your looking at your experience and looking at your job profile and looking at your past career and your education he might feel that ki you are expecting around somewhere so and so and he might not call you for the interview at all but when you put it across in a simple way that this is my expectation he will understand oh let me call this guy he looks much better now okay generally this will be discussed in the interview process of course yes the salary will be discussed in the interview process but to call for interview the person should keep a mindset ki i am ready to pay only 25k his expectation is 50k he will not call you for the interview fine 
But when he calls for the interview and he says that, sir, I'm looking for 50K and 25K, and automatically there will be a big disappointment where you'll feel that yeah, I have been for the interview, but that person is not looking for it. And he will not say that we cannot afford you to pay 50K. So it is very clear if you mention it 25K or whatever the expectations you have, the company also keeps a mindset that at least, yeah, I can call that person and the expectation can be met because both of them have a win win policy where they will understand this, this guy is suitable for this job. So make sure that you put it across in a better way that wherever the ask kind of a thing, if you put it across, this is my expectation. The expected salary is around 10K or 1.2 lakhs or 1.5 lakhs per annum. So this will help the person who's taking an interview or the employer or the company to understand the board members will understand that this is what expectations, what you want, what the person wants to have. So please put it across. It's nothing wrong in that, but never have two minds. Do not put anything between 10 to 15 is fine. No, please split it very precisely. If you want 10, 10, 12, 12, 15, 15, do not put it across in one single go. 10 to 15, which gives again a dilemma. The person will also, okay, sir, I, let me give you 10 only. He will never give you 15. If you want 15, put it 15. So next is uh, content and structure. How, what kind of a content it should be there? It should be using, you should be using short and bulleted statements. Do not use big, big paragraphs where people will not be able to read it. Use numbers and percentages in a appropriate manner. Avoid personal pronounces like I, me, I can give company to this. No, please try to be more uh, plural and uh, use the verbs properly. Statements and action verbs should be very much clear. Font, always try to do 10 to 12 or it can be 13. Bold for your name. Always highlight your names or wherever you want to highlight your so education, whatever it is, please highlight that. Position dates, please cre create your monthly years and everything should be very much clear. Paper always should be white, no other color papers. Spacing should be one or two line spacing and do not keep everything in bold. Do not keep everything in italics, wherever it is required, proper punctuation should be there. Have a sentence uh, framework. Do not go for uh, writing everything in the bold letters or in the capital letters or all in small letters. Wherever it is required, please use a punctuation in an appropriate way, which looks much better to read. Whichever the important points are there, you want to highlight, you can make it bold, you can make it capital, but not all the points. So these are the few things, everyone knows this, but just make sure that when you prepare your resume, when you align your resume, once it is prepared, look into this kind of a points where it gives more pleasant look on your resume, where people get interested to see the resume. Because again, I said the first impression is always the best impression. If your resume looks good, the people will be interested to call you for the interview. Always, uh, this is a simple thing, Arial, Tohoma, Vardana, the Times New Roman are the few things which can be used as a fonts. Very simple, 10 to 12 sizes of fonts. Avoid lots of bold italics. I, I've already said you, tables and underlinings, all those things. Use keywords for your industries and jobs. Try to understand wherever you put, if the industry is connected to some kind of a manufacturing process, try to use those kind of words where people get attracted, where the person gets attracted and understands the value of the uh, value of your resume and see understand yes he's, this person is connected to my industry i can recruit him do not use header or footer please write it in a very crisp manner no header and footer on this S send a document always on dot doc or dot docx and not a pdf format never use a pdf format because it looks very odd uh, try to use a proper uh, word document itself which moves much better the next is create this is a basic understanding of a resume. But when you give your resume, try to understand that always when you're being called for an interview, try to think much better. You try to understand one thing, you need to prepare something else also. When you give your resume or in a nice file proper way, put it across a covering letter should be there. A covering letter should be mentioning few things, which is the most important thing. The first and most important thing is why you require a cover letter. Can anyone send me that? Why a cover letter is important? Have you ever seen a cover letter? Yes, friends, put it in the chat box first. Why a cover letter is important? Generally, it will discuss in personally in interview. Okay, that is the old one. And please let me know. Have you? What do you understand by a cover letter?
Sanjay sir and Prajwal sir, if uh, are the people understanding what I am speaking actually? Yes sir. Or if Arthak did not answer, then I am. I think ah. still now they are responding. Good, good. So that is most important thing. Or Arthak did not answer. Nija. And participants, kuda. Ah, yari ka dhoru, yella dhoru doubt banto atwa Arthak agali landre. You can ask. Ah, or. ಹೇಳ್ತಾರೆ ನಿಮಗೆ ಮತ್ತೊಂದ್ ಸತಿ ಬೇಕಾದ್ರೆ ಎಗೇನ್ ಯಾವ್ದಾದ್ರು ಕನ್ನಡದಲ್ಲಿ ರಿಪೀಟೇಷನ್ ಮಾಡ್ಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಇದ್ರು ಕೂಡ ಯಾವ ಕಾರಣಕ್ಕೂ ಯಾವ ಮೂಮೆಂಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ನಿಮ್ಗೆ ಅನ್ಸುತ್ತೆ ಸರ್ ನೀವು ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ಒಂದ್ ನಿಮಿಷ ಈ ಮಾತನ್ನ ತಿರ್ಗಾ ಹೇಳ್ತೀರ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ತುಂಬಾ ಖುಷಿ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಯಾಕಂದ್ರೆ ನೀವು ಅರ್ಥ ಮಾಡಿಲ್ಲ ನಾನು ಮುಂದೆ ಹೋಗದ್ರು ಏನೋ ಪ್ರಯೋಜನ ಇಲ್ಲ ಸೊ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ನಿಮ್ಮನ್ನು ಮನ್ಸಲ್ಲಿ ಇಟ್ಕೋಬೇಡಿ ನಾನು ಕೇಳಕ್ ಆಗಲ್ಲ ಕೇಳಬಹುದ ಅಥವಾ ಏನು ಕಾರಣಕ್ಕೆ ಯೋಚನೆ ಮಾಡ್ಬೇಡಿ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ವಿ ಶುಡ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಗ್ರೋ ಇನ್ ಅರ್ ಲೈಫ್ ನಾವು ಗ್ರೋ ಮಾಡ್ಬೇಕಾಗಿದ್ರೆ ನಾವು ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಮಾತಾಡೋದು ಕಲಿಬೇಕು ಮಾತಾಡೋದು ಕಲ್ತಿಲ್ಲ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ತುಂಬಾ ಕಷ್ಟ ಆಗತ್ತೆ ಮನ್ಸಲ್ಲಿದ್ರೆ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ಇಮಿಡಿಯೇಟ್ ಕೇಳ್ಕೋಬೇಕು ಆಮೇಲೆ ಯಾವಾಗ ಟೈಮ್ ಸಿಗತ್ತೆ ಈ ಸೆಷನ್ ಮುಗ್ದೋದ್ ನಂತರ ನೀವು ಕ್ವಶನ್ಸ್ ಕೇಳಿದ್ರು ಕೂಡ ಅರ್ಥ ಆಗಲ್ಲ ಅಥವಾ ನಾನ್ ಕನೆಕ್ಟ್ ಸಿಕ್ಕಿಲ್ಲ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಮಾಡಕ್ ಆಗಲ್ಲ ಸೊ ಲೈಫ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಏನೋ ಕೇಳ್ಬೇಕಾದ ಆಸಕ್ತಿ ಇದೆ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ಕೇಳಿ ಸೊ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಬಿ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಸೆಷನ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ So covering letter is the most important part for any kind of an interview resume where you provide. If you, when you apply for a job, a resume, when you put it across, put a covering letter. Why covering letter is important? It gives an impression of what kind of a person you are, what kind of an understanding you have with, for the company. And it accomplishes and tells a resume in a short and notice where you can put it across okay, what you will be looking for in a precise manner. It is a summary where you will be telling, this is my potential and this is where I stand strong. and i can give your company and this this if you give me a job this this will be the better thing and i'll be creating your matlab i'll be creating and making the company grow in coming years in a bigger way so always try to do that use this help the employer to convince also why you are best candidate because you'll be putting in a very precise and summarized manner that you understand the position for which you are applying for because this will help them understand because the resume will not give everything and why you should consider for entry interview matlab you can put it across immediately ki how to why it is important to call for an interview because we will be understanding more from you and what position you are applying that is also makes understand people in this in a simple manner always try to see that this should be having a multiple paras or 3 to 4 paras where you will be describing yourself with start with the normal uh, proper date that should be important the person the company person the person whom you are addressing any kind of an employer or a manager put his name that is most important do not use the word whom so where it may concern it doesn't look good on the covering letter for the resume there will be a job profile there will be a company uh, employer or the uh, company manager or ceo who where it is put it across his name his designation with the company address and address with the proper dear or respected sir and put it across ki what kind of things you are looking for in the company enclose please find the resume for your consideration i am very much interested in the senior customer service manager position posted in xyz company's website so this will help them to understand ki where have you seen this where have you seen this job application where have you seen this job ad so that you are applying for it is not it is not a vague thing where people will not understand because they looking to that ki they will, and few of the questions what they ask in interview it has been solved and resolved over here there will be more of uh, better at interviews will be having better interaction will be happening because they will be knowing you much better before ki what kind of a person whom your interview has been done so try to understand ki you try to make it more precise make it much better and put it it across in the covering letter itself did you all guys get it what is covering letter the next important is your business uh, connections your uh, if you have any uh, references the most of the time we provide references to them so but first understand prepare a separate page do not attach to the resume or do not put it on the same page of the resume have a separate page mentioning about your networks or if a reference we have do not include on your resume very important have a separate page do not include on your resume reference available upon request always try to understand if anyone asking if you have any reference please show it to them otherwise if you don't ask do not show to them prepare at least three references usually either two professional and one personal and three personals on the professional platform because that will help them to connect if the company is been having a good reputation with some other company and you have a connect with that company this will help them to understand 
if this this person is connected to so and so company if any of his friends is connected for example my friends gives me a reference ke hitesh go and get the job over there this is the job which is suited to you and i go and sit over there and if they ask me what is the how do you get the reference from them i just put it across my friends name this will help the person to get build a trust on you because reference is most important thing so they will automatically this guy is a friend of this so and so person and automatically they will feel that yeah we can trust on him and we can give the job and job will be granted so always try to understand the reference is most important thing take the reference page with you at the time of the interview and by but submit only if they ask you if they don't ask please do not try to submit or do not try to showcase yourself ke sir na he is no he is known to me aur nane gotti jare nane aur gotti jare aur gotti jare please no if they ask please tell them if you don't ask let let's be quiet but this reference page will help you to get connected to the company more easily when you carry for the interviews always have this three for this few things when the prepared beforehand send immediately after the interview the card a letter a phone call or email telling the showing the gratitude or thanks to the person who has taken and the company also thanking them giving me an opportunity to, to give an interview at your company to send my resume at your company which helps me looking forward to work with you come with your company this will connect the people and directly this will help the people to understand ki wow this person has some kind of a gratitude to and the, where people get connected and they will be remembering you before they allot the job so this is something building the connection slowly with the employer and the company before getting into the company for the job so these are few things which we understand for to prepare the resume i have taken very crisp and short on the resume print if you want if you really want to take the resume complete structure then we need to spend across around 4 hours for the whole day session where we can understand what kind of a resume and this which kind of a professional what kind of a resume is has to be prepared there are different professions different resumes there are different types of resumes which chronological order which been prepared which is prepared in a contemporary matter which is prepared in a very formal matter so there are different kind of a resumes which can be prepared this app just tests the simple format where you people can understand and apply for a job immediately uh, the college life is totally different my dear friends once you are out of the college life totally changes because life after college is something special where you need to understand and that that's where the success of the life really comes it's not necessary the person who has got 100% marks or 90% marks or 99% marks in their exams will get success in their life it is uh, and it's not that a 40% student or 60% student will fail in the life life after college gives a different challenges it might be the vice versa or different kind of a thing and the person success depends on his own career his own ability to understand and his own goals which are the most important thing and that is where you become more successful in your life so moving ahead interview any doubts in resume friends before we move to interviews yaro ko sound kelista ide maatadabodu avaru bekadre doubts yavudu illva no no anta bartta ide no anta bartta ide ಡೌಟ್ಸ್ ಬರ್ತಾ ಇಲ್ಲ ಪ್ರಜ್ವಲ್ ಸರ್ ಒಂದು ಡೌಟ್ ನನಗೆ ಬರ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಅವರು ನಾನು ಹೇಳಿದೆಲ್ಲ ಡೌಟ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಏನಂದ್ರೆ ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ನಾನು ಹೇಳಿದೆಲ್ಲ ಅರ್ಥ ಆಗಿಲ್ಲ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ನೋ ಡೌಟ್ ಅರ್ಥ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಆಗಿದೆ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ನೋ ಡೌಟ್ ನನಗೆ ಭಯ ಆಗ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ತನಕ ತುಂಬಾ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿ ಅರ್ಥ ಆಗಿದೆ ಅಂತ ಅನ್ಸುತ್ತೆ ಐತೆ ಸರ್ ತುಂಬಾ ಕ್ಲಾರಿಟಿ ಹೇಳಿದೀರಾ ಸೊ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಲೆಟ್ಸ್ ಮೂವ್ ಹೆಡ್ ಪ್ರಜ್ವಲ್ ಸರ್ ಪರ್ಮಿಷನ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಮೂವ್ ಹೆಡ್ ವಿತ್ ಇಂಟರ್ವ್ಯೂ ದ ಇಂಟರ್ವ್ಯೂ ಪ್ರೊಸೆಸ್ ಸರ್ ಮೆರಿಡಿಯಲ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟಸ್ ಅಥವಾ ಪೇರೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ನೇಮ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಆಗತ್ತಾ ಕೆಲವ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಎವ್ರಿ ಟೈಮ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಆಗಲ್ಲ ಬಟ್ ಕೆಲವ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಮ್ಯಾರಿಟಿಯಲ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಮ್ಯಾರಿಡ್ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ದ ಕಂಪನಿ ವಿಲ್ ಫೀಲ್ ದಟ್ ಕೆ ಇವನ್ ಮ್ಯಾರಿಡ್ ಆಗಿಲ್ಲ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಎಷ್ಟು ಜವಾಬ್ದಾರಿ ತಗೊಂತಾನೆ ಮ್ಯಾರಿಡ್ ಆದ್ಮೇಲೆ ಜವಾಬ್ದಾರಿ ಎಷ್ಟು ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತ ಗೊತ್ತಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಸೊ ವೆರಿ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ನೀವು ಅದನ್ನ ಹಾಕಿದ್ರೆ ಒಳ್ಳೇದು ಬಟ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಪೇರೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಬೇಕಾದ್ರೆ ನೀವು ಅದನ್ನ ಬೇಕಾಗಿದ್ರೆ ಹಾಕೋಬಹುದು ಕೆಲವ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಪೇರೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಹೆಸರು ಹಾಕಿದ್ರು ಕೂಡ ದರ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂಸ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ if i put it across ki i am so and so son of the so and so person if the person my father dad is really doing good and some kind of a good value is created his credits will be taken to my credits and he will see that aur maga idu nijavaglu chanaga maartana anta on aasakti irutte on iddirutte so aa karanakke always try to put the parents name also and always one thing is there ki the person who is put as parents name avar hesra hakadre automatic avar eshtu chana kandide avar tande tai hesra hakad mele avargu ond hemme sigutte avaru on maryada sigutte ki avar at least this person his gratitude to his parents also gives his gives importance to his parents also 
So these all with small small things, but gives great values actually. So it gives the great character what you believe into actually. What kind of a person you are, it gives direct picture for the person to understand. So try to put the parents name. Nothing wrong in that. Okay, sir. Thank you. Very other doubts, sir. Resume back here. Friends, sir, Nivala, second PU or the most aspiring to become into getting your degree, sir. So when you put it across, that I have studied my, if I put it my across in my resume, that I have done my MBA, uh, I have done my bachelor's of business management, I have done my tenth standard, I have done so and so courses. So how does it look like actually? What is the chronological order actually if you put it across? The chronological order is very simple. If you have done your tenth standard, you want to put it highlight in one of the best school. What you have done, you will be putting first tenth standard. Then you will be putting. You have done graduation in so and so course, and then you will be putting the post graduation in so and so. You will not be putting from high to low. You will be putting always low to high. So make sure that you write with your resume very precise way. Whatever your achievements are low, which will be first, and on the higher side you put it across. Even in your achievements, even in your kind of a different things, wherever you receive some kind of awards or something like that, put it across in a chronological order where people understand. and if you don't have to put the 10th standard people really knows that when you have done your post graduation of your graduation or if you study the college of course you have done your 10th standard without 10th standard you cannot move ahead so look into that which is important point that only you put it across in your resumes so next moving ahead uh, interviews interviews are the most important and best part uh, where we can enjoy actually it's a kind of a interaction where people gives uh you understand what company is all about what kind of a things you look into that so understand uh, so let me understand from you guys uh, have you all been for an interview before and what kind of an experience you had and what is basically an interview interview andre yeno interview andre madve aga munche huduga hudige nodu adunu interview ne kelsad mele hogam munche adunu interview ne स्कूल अथवा कॉलेज जॉन के ना प्रिंसिपल बेटे आगे अब इंटरव्यू ने बट वाट इज डिफरेंस वाट कैंड प्रोफेसनल इंटरव्यू कैन बी ये प्लीज इफ यू हव गुड पर्सेंटेज प्लीज पुट इट अक्रॉस पलवी आज दट शुड बी मेन्शन द पर्सेंटेज वाट वी हव अचीव इन टेन स्टैंडर्ड ये अफकोर्स प्लीज पुट इट अक्रॉस नथिंग रॉंग इन इट If you have got eighty percent, ninety percent, sixty percent, whatever it is, and if you feel it is not important to mention, then don't mention. It depends on your uh, idea that what it is really important or not. So understand which will which adds value. Anything which adds enhances your enhances your persona on the resume. Put it across immediately because that will add value. If it doesn't add anything, no point in putting. Basically, if you see a resume, uh, I think uh, what. introduction was been given for me is also basically an information what i did in my life actually so it is basically writing introduction things about yourself so whatever elevates you whatever makes you better put it across in the resume do not try to hesitate to write that because that will really add value to your resume yes friends what is interviews interview andre you know so before we go understand interview the first important thing it is important is today's job market is more competitive friends artha maadkoli ivattin job ivattin market yav rithi ide antre job kelor jaasti jana idare job kadme ide but adralli best person na tagobekandre company aasakti irutte so competition adhe tara beled bitide elladrallu now better aagbeku skills develop aagbeku technology update aagirbeku so understand one more thing before applying for a job lean understand ki what kind of a qualities what kind of a skill you carry has to be most important thing under read the market research ki what kind of people are looking for jobs and what kind of people are taken into the jobs so adu artha maadkonde devittu niva job profile la fill maadkoli next is you need to be able to be effectively communication communication skill bagge nimge thumba important to today's company so understand one more thing if you don't know english it is not important how effectively you can communicate that is most important thing kannada nalli ni maatadadre kannada nalli maatadi because if you want to do business in karnataka itself you need to understand only kannada you don't have to look into for any other language apart from kannada so kannada nalli chanaga maatadabodu andre so why do you want to learn 
why do you want to put it across in english it is not necessary and if you are not comfortable english do not try to touch that but always understand ki what kind of a communication you can do that communication has to be properly done so have the best skills understand what you can speak how can you can speak and what impression you can create so communication skill is most important thing before any interviews or the job you want to apply next is the duration of interview process you want to highlight as many of your strength is possible so if you go for an interview let it be 5 minutes or 10 minutes your interview process understand you show the best to best to the person if you don't show them the best to best they will not be able to understand you much better because they will be judging you in just 5 minutes you what uh qualities you carry and this if you've been added to the company what value you can create for the company if you don't impress them in next 5 minutes your interview process will be failing so understand always try to understand ki these are the few things before interview process please understand ki what you are doing actually competition is high you need to have good quality of speaking you need to have good qualities of understanding your sense of humor should be high you should understand ki what kind of first and foremost thing most important thing is maatanna kalibeku communication skill adanna nu maadilla andre nu yen alli maatadtira kashta agibidutte maatadakke nervousness so how many of you are nervous to go for interview nervousness baruta just put it up or yes or no chat box alli do you are you nervous to go for interviews bhaya agata interview hoglike maatadakke how do yes no one says no tejaswini says yes aditya says yes sanjay says yes amit says yes deepak says yes sushant says yes everyone saying yes so no one is saying no yaarigu bhaya ellarigu bhaya agutte bhaya aagde iravaru yaru illa nervousness illiravaru yaru illa ivattu great so friends uh, it's good actually if, if you are nervous 100% you are normal not so navya navya says not much of nervous when she goes for the interview friends if you are nervous i said as i said uh, it is something which is a normal thing which every people feels actually to take a session today also i was nervous before starting the even session similarly when you go for interview 100% human tendency says that we get nervous but to become confident that's a different thing nervousness is different thing and getting confidence on nervousness is different thing and if you guys are not nervous nimmalli manasali ondu nervousness illa andre please get checked and diagnosed by the doctor because yena problem ide the nervous yakandre bhaya ellaru gagutte ee situation alli so yarige bhaya agutte or any kind of a nervousness idre they are normal so be normal enjoy the process of interview it is very uh, enjoyable because this is a kind of a special thing or experiences which adds to your own career and it is a kind of a beautiful thing where you go for before the interview process or the, before the job is been given to you it's enjoyment so next moving ahead uh, after understanding the what kind of an employee or what is the market is actually how do you research yourself how do you make more competitive yourself the most important small small skills which is most important how to be a top interviewer skills but how what kind of an interviews interviews if you go before to the interview and understand ki what kind of a skill you should carry the one thing is very simple this is self explanatory i will not going in detail i'll be just telling you prepare well always understand ki what kind of a interview process you are going for so prepare according to that be punctual the most important thing is be punctual go 15 20 minutes before the interviews happen you can understand the scenario over there what kind of a people are sitting over there how you have been called everything will be comfortable late if you go you will be missing all those things and you will be always fumbling over there and making the interview process into a wrong way think before you speak always try to understand speak whatever is required you should be knowing how much to speak when to speak why to speak and if it is most important thing is where to stop bari maatadade agala so always to be constrained to all these things why when and how and where to be stop of speaking speak clearly as i said the communication skills has to be most important thing if you don't have proper communication skill again you will face a problem so speak clearly cohesively whichever language you are comfortable if you are like good at kannada please speak in kannada do not try to attempt in english if you are good at english please go ahead if you are good at hindi please go ahead any language where the interview process or employer understands please go in that kind of a language 
be confident never be arrogant always be humble try to be more expressive most more gratitude do not show any arrogance or attitude which will create a wronger impact listen well the most important thing is speak less and listen more in interview process wherever it is required you speak that moment otherwise just listen to them which will add and express gratitude as i said always be thankful to them because if you get the job or not that is secondary but when a company calls for interview always express your gratitude and show humbleness which will add and give good value to your own character so these are a few things which is very self explanatory and which we do normally we do understand but make sure that you understand things these are the checklist of a good person who will go for the interview if you don't have follow this checklist dress well groom well all these things are there most important thing if you don't wear proper dress also you will be not getting an attraction because the first impression again creates the best impression so understand one more thing any people uh, i just wanted to ask few people what is the person looks for the first thing where in your very what you wear in dress i'll be just touching the small part of grooming over here where you'll be understanding more things anyone sees you what he sees first in you in your dress yaar nodidru kuda nu nimmalli first nimma dress alli yen nodtare what kind of a dress you are wearing or anything else they would help us yes please we can put in a chat box what is the one thing important or what is the things which people really look into your neatness of course you have to be neat you have to be presentable you have to be much properly groomed before going to an interview okay anything else friends apart from that neatness ad mele specific age decency okay neatness decency we are going more on the precise on the uh, okay color combinations of dress of course yes you cannot wear the govinda colors yellow, yellow orange blue combinations and all those things always be more of formal dress of course do not wear any casual spray proper shirts tucked in or uh, there is no formal dress for females actually wear a proper dress which looks or suiting uh, which looks good on you it is not there any kind of formal dress for females but of course for the men it is very formal it should be more into more of uh, casual formal wear like shirts and trousers no wearing of jeans or t-shirt are going for the interviews a proper tie or a blazer will add value to that uh, friends when we say about dress the first and foremost thing what a people see on any kind of a platform let it be interview or any place where you meet first time also people try to see the first is the shoes always try to wear a proper shoes no slippers or nothing like that always have a better shoes which looks much better ladies a better slippers because that where the people see first you just under, just visualize yourself you also do that even i do the same wherever we see first we our eyes goes on the shoes what kind of a shoes if the shoes are not polished automatically your own character or your own persona goes down always wear the proper shoes with the proper matching belt because a belt and the shoes are common colors what we wear and dressed as i said there should be a good color combination of the dresses that is most important thing ladies properly pin up yourself pin up your uh, hair properly uh, if you try and try to uh, have a proper uh, uh, grooming on your hair that is the most important thing which will add enhance your confidence level in the better way because if you look good you are more confident if you are confident you will speak well if you speak well you will be successful so these are a few things on the grooming concept just understand this thing uh, just before going for an interview you should be more confident enough by having a proper dress and everything and the other checklist is on the screen where you can follow this uh, before going for an interview process so once the resume has been done you are ready for the interview what you should see and what kind of an seventh uh, interview skills has to be followed so next is the seven things you should follow in an interview if you follow these seven skills you will be enhancing yourself and a being a better person and making yourself in a good way so first one is always say i am familiar with what your company does because that's the most important thing always try to understand ki when you are going for a so and so company try to look into their website what they do actually what kind of a client they have what kind of a production they do what kind of a business they do what kind of an employees they have what is the best usp thing of that company if you all understand those things 
it will be much easier to converse with the interviewer and he will be feeling good that you know so much good things about the company so always be more familiar about a company before going to interview do some kind of a research do not go directly blank without knowing anything about a company do good research about a company good understanding about a company and always speak positively about a company where you will be feeling more comfortable in conversating with the interviewer the first important thing is always be familiar with do's and don'ts of the company which helps you to make more comfortable more confident between the interview process the second is i am flexible always try to be flexible today's employers look into more of flexibility the flexibility might be working style might be in your uh, timings it might be extra time workings you should be ready for everything you should be flexible to adapt the changes if it is required and also it might be like a uh, additional job duties any kind of a job duty you are doing some particular job but you are good into that also and they feel that please help me with this you should be flexible to help the company in creating a job different kind of a job where you will be having a great enjoyment next is the company employers always look into the category of i am energetic and and i am positive attitude so please be positive always be energetic do not be kind of a, a lethargic or any kind of a always go so confidently and confidence comes only when you are properly dressed when you know knowledge when you can speak well automatically everything will come if you have knowledge you will speak if you don't have knowledge you automatically will not be able to speak so keep the proper knowledge on your mindset if this is what the knowledge and what you have studied what you have done what is about you what you how have you filled your resume please everything keep in your mind and always company believes in can do attitude he never company will always look into that we can do it it is not that they will never think that we cannot i cannot we cannot do there will not be negative thinking it will be always a positive thinking where the interviewers will be always looking at your energy your positivity and your attitude how you carry yourself this is the most important thing before going an interview always try to understand that experience is also most important and always showcase that i have a great deal of experience in so and so when you have experience you'll be having a knowledge when you have knowledge you'll speak about your experience and if you don't have all those things automatically you will not be able to speak anything so experience in speaking experience in understanding the company experience what you have done before and what you are you are doing please put your experiences in a better way so try to understand that these are things which can be introspected sit home and understand what you can do because if you don't understand those things it will be really difficult friends the next is always have a team be a team player work with a team the company doesn't look for a person who is working single he is always looking the company always or the employer always looks ki how you works with the other people or as a leader how you carry other people these are the few things which is the most important thing if you are selfish if you are intro self intro what no one will try to understand you and they will try to say that no we cannot take you as in our company but if you have a high spirit to work with the team as a team player you can accomplish few goals of the company automatically company will be happy to take you and company will say that yes the company has increased and getting the success because of you so always be a team player showcase themselves ki what can you do with the team what can you achieve for your life what can you do a lot of things in your life always say that i am expert always i am seeking ex- to become an expert in any kind of a field because you should be a learner if you have got some kind of a job that job if you just reach to get receive to that you will not be able to grow in your life so to always show that you can become expert in any kind of a field where you can learn more always try to understand if i am given this field also i am ready to do sir because that is what is most important thing the company looks for company looks for more of diversified and the the, the same field you are working in so when an employer is taking an interview he will be looking your expertise what can you can do and what you can showcase and what you can give for the company back the next important is always try to be aspirant always try to be highly motivated if you're not motivated the company will not feel a positive energy in you so you should always be highly motivated to do things take risk in your life achieve lot of big goals make sure that your goals will give you a lot of energy and you will achieve your goals in a just short short span of a time once one goal is completed the next goal starts so where there where with again the motivation is required yourself and self motivation is the most important thing rather anyone trying to inspire or aspire but first is own first have to we have to inspire ourselves we have to aspire ourselves then only we'll be getting the success in our life so i lead always try to be highly motivated the company employer looks always 
for a highly motivated person ha ah, the last and the bottom line what is it all about a job interview is an opportunity i always believe me friends when you go for an interview it is to sell yourself how you will market yourself how will you sell yourself how will you impress the employer automatically that will be the success for your life and if you're not able to sell yourself it is really difficult for you to grow in your life so as i said introspect please understand ಮನೆಗೆ ಹೋಗ್ಬಿಟ್ಟು ಅಥವಾ ಇವತ್ತಿನ ವರ್ಕ್ಶಾಪ್ ಆದ್ಮೇಲೆ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ತಮ್ಮನ್ನೇ ಅರ್ಥ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳಿ ನಾವ್ ನಾವ್ ಏನಿದೀವಿ ಅಂತ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಬೆಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವಾಲಿಟೀಸ್ ಏನಿದೆ ಒಂದ್ ಪೇಪರ್ ಬರೀಲಿ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಗುಡ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಏನಿದೆ ಅದನ್ನ ಬರೀರಿ ನೀವ್ ಏನ್ ಮಾಡಬಹುದು ವಾಟ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ಲೈಫ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಲೀಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ಸಕ್ಸಸ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಪುಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಕ್ರಾಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ ಯು ಟು ಸ್ಪೀಕ್ ವೆಲ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ರಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಂಟರ್ವ್ಯೂಯರ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಶೋ ಯುವರ್ ಕಾನ್ಫಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಲೆವೆಲ್ ಹೈ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಶೋ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಮೋರ್ ಈಸಿಲಿ ಅಂಡ್ ಯುಲ್ ಬಿ ಏಬಲ್ ಟು ಸೆಲ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಇನ್ ಅ ವೆರಿ ಪಾಸಿಟಿವ್ ವೇ ಅಂಡ್ ವೆರಿ ವಿಲ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಅ ಸಕ್ಸಸ್ ಆಸ್ early as possible did you all get it so small things that does matter in our life always stay positive is the most important thing is next is you may think whatever we have learned today it might be just an extra work man sel ellaru aagta ide yena pa job interview ella yen maadbekagilla ange sikibidutala kelsugala ella sikate but always try to understand the difference between employed and unemployed always try to understand the thin line which is very much important to understand ki what is life of employed and what is the life of unemployed this might be small things which is more which are which has been said today but always this creates a bigger impact in your life if the, when i say self intro introspection what we do namanna nam artha maadkobekagira ad important to adanna maadi devittu automatically you will understand ki what kind of a person you are and where your positive things are stronger and where you have to correct yourself this will help you to grow in your life and it's all about getting the job done very simple friends yavudukku madu kuda no namma abhipraya yen andre namma goal life alli yen ide adanna complete madbeku automatically i should get my job means i should get my job that is where we go for interview process and remember to always focus on a big picture nan avaginda guri life in guri bage maatartta idini aa guri namma manasalli yen ide daivittu adanna dodda gettkoli when it has been said by one of the socrates that try to achieve try to hit the sky you will be at least hitting the stars which is again a great success yavattu kuda nimma goal ana doddaga ittkoli dodd pakkada on nintkondu kuda nenap maadkondu kuda illa nimmanna nimma goal na kelle takshane avunge nagu barbeku ye nin kai laagalla anta parvagilla nimma goal na bage yaru nagulilla yav nagu bandilla andre idu abdul kalam sir helirodo if your goals if you by listening to your goals if the person doesn't laugh then your goals are not strong enough always your goal should be such a big that let the people laugh at their laugh at your goal or let them shiver is it really possible aa goal na nu met bodu aa goal na maad bodu nothing is impossible because impossible also says very simple i am possible so few things just wanted to tell you before i conclude this session always try to be understanding the most important the value of the word giving is a magical word sure shot way getting the most always yaragu kododa prayatna padkoli yakandre nivu yavattu giving nature idkondre automatically life will become more positive and things will become more easy for you guys always have this one important thing and help others to achieve their dream and your dreams will be taken care friends this is also very important thing bere dreams na bere guri or na bere mans kanasanna anna nivu sarthaka maade prayatna padi automatically nimma dreams nimma kanasu automatic sarthak agutte nimma life alli success mettira so these are few things which is important idana artha maadkoli giving is important and helping others to achieve their dream is most important thing when you do do these two things you are automatically life will become much bigger and much entertaining and much more great things and you will have success and for this success you will be having people to cherish with you so this is most important thing So always do one thing and this is uh, JC Hitesh Giriya from the JCI Bangalore Garden City Zalom and this is my contact number and my mail ID. If you guys have any queries you can ask right away now itself or you always you can text me on SMS on WhatsApp or you can mail me any kind of a details so that I can help you guys to grow in your life. So this is uh, I JC Hitesh Giriya signing off and just let me know any kind of a doubts if you have. It's an open platform for everyone to speak so you guys can speak easily. to me yavade karanaku nimma manasalli yavade doubts idre daivittu keli yakandre doubt anna manasalli ittkobedi if you have understood everything i am really happy if you have still have some kind of a doubts 
ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ಅದನ್ನ ಕೇಳಿ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಮನ್ಸಲ್ಲಿ ಇಟ್ಕೊಂಡಿರೋ ಡೌಟ್ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಆಗಲ್ಲ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಅದನ್ನ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಮಾಡಕ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಸಿಕ್ಕಲ್ಲ ಲೈಫ್ ಅನ್ನ ಬೆಳಿಬೇಕಂದ್ರೆ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ನಿಮ್ ಮನ್ಸಲ್ಲಿ ಏನಿದ್ರು ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ಕೇಳಿ ಎವ್ರಿ ಒನ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಆನ್ ದರ್ ವಿಡಿಯೋ ಸ್ಕ್ರೀನ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಐ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸೀ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಆಸ್ ಡೌಟ್ಸ್ ಬೈ ಅನ್ಮೀಟಿಂಗ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಸ್ನೇಹಿತರೆ ನಿಮಗೆ ಯಾವುದೇ ಪ್ರಶ್ನೆಗಳಿದ್ರೆ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ಆಪರ್ಚುನಿಟಿ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಗಾಟ್ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಯಾವುದೇ ಪ್ರಶ್ನೆಗಳಿಗೆ ಹಿ ವಿಲ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಒಂದು ಒಂದೂವರೆ ಗಂಟೆ ಅದ್ಭುತವಾದಂತಹ ಸೆಷನ್ ನ ಕೇಳಿದರೆ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಸಮ್ ಡೌಟ್ಸ್ ಕೆಲವೊಂದು ಸಣ್ಣ ಪುಟ್ಟ ಡೌಟ್ಸ್ ಇದ್ರು ಪರವಾಗಿಲ್ಲ ಹಿ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ವೆರಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಟು ಆನ್ಸರ್ ರೆಡ್ಮಿ ಕೇಳಿ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ತಮ್ಮ ಹೆಸರು ಹೇಳ್ಬಿಟ್ಟು ಕೇಳಿ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು Redmi, unmute ma, ma If you have any questions, ಮಾಡಿದ ನಿಮ್ ಕೇಳಬಹುದು ನೀವು ಹಲೋ ಸರ್ ಎಸ್ ಕೇಳಿ ಕೇಳಿ ಸರ್ ರೆಸ್ಯೂಮ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ನಮ್ಮ ಹ್ಯಾಬಿಟ್ಸ್ ನ ತುಂಬಾ ಇದ್ರೆ ಬ್ರೀಫ್ ಆಗಿ ಬರೀಬೇಕಾ ಅಥವಾ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಮೆನ್ಶನ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೆ ಸಾಕ್ರಿಕೆಟ್ ಆಡೋ ತುಂಬಾ ಆಸಕ್ತಿ ಇದೆ ಅದನ್ನ ಬರೀಬಹುದು ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಲುಕ್ ಐ ಲವ್ ಟು ರೀಡ್ ಬುಕ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಗುಡ್ when you say about habits habits are totally different things if you say that habit that i get up at 10 o'clock this is my habit he will say please be staying at home sir don't come to office so it is under, uh, sushant understand yen madbekagide andre illi nimma yenu resume l barithirala adanna important ne nimma life na nimmana nimma charitravanna elevate madutala if it shows sir, it shows that you are a good person and making yourself much better adanna baribeku yavada nimmana down madutade devittu adanna baribedi because always try to understand if a person if the things written by you is not elevating you it is no, then the, the person will not get attracted something it should be good about yourself you can write anything in the resume in a proper way hobbies also should be written in a precise crisp manner adana beli dora bari bardo nanu cricket aada thumba aasakti ide hindin varshadalli nanu nalak cricket tournament aadidde adralli i tournament alli nalak tournament alli nanu 100 century mur sali odididini adala bariyadbekagilla you can just say i am a good cricket player this is my hobby this will enhance that too much of writing things you can it is not good so okay, you can sir. put it in the chat box also yaro kelak manasik bartha first point ellaru maatadad kalibekappa doubt idre devittu chat box al bariyabedi open ag unmute maadi maatadi okay ee time ali sir i am going to add some inputs hithe uh, sir hithe uh, sir yen helidru it is ರಿಯಲಿ ಟ್ರೂ ಯಾಕೆ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಟುಡೆ ನಮ್ಮ ಇವತ್ತಿನ ಎಜುಕೇಶನ್ ಸಿಸ್ಟಮ್ ತುಂಬಾ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಗಿದೆ ತುಂಬಾ ಹಿಂದುಳಿದಿದೆ ನಾರ್ಮಲಿ ನಿನ್ನೆ ನಾನೊಂದು ಸರ್ವೆ ನೋಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೆ ನಿಯರ್ಲಿ ನಲ್ವತ್ತು ಲಕ್ಷ ಜನ ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಔಟ್ಪುಟ್ ಆಗ್ತಾ ಇದಾರೆ ಅಂಡ್ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ದೇ ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ಹೌ ಟು ಪ್ರಿಪೇರ್ ದೇರ್ ರೆಸ್ಯೂಮ್ ದೇ ನೋ ಟು ಪ್ರಿಪೇರ್ ಬಟ್ ಎಫೆಕ್ಟಿವ್ ಆಗಿ ಹೇಗೆ ಪ್ರಿಪೇರ್ ಮಾಡ್ಬೇಕು ಒಂದು ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಹೇಗೆ ಪ್ರಿಪೇರ್ ಮಾಡ್ಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಗೊತ್ತಿಲ್ಲ ಇಂಟರ್ವ್ಯೂ ನ ಅಟೆಂಡ್ ಮಾಡೋ ಬಗ್ಗೆ ಯಾರು ಹೇಳ್ಕೊಡಲ್ಲ no one will tell how to face interview anta ivattena esto college galalli so nanu obru hr hatra maatadta idde on few months back avaru helta idru yake especially village students athwa malnadu students ee chakade yake hedirtar andre they don't have proper english communication english language strength anta avaru heltare nimige english language barbek anta illa they expect you to have a proper communication avrige artha aguvanta communication irbeku anta ಹಾಗಾಗಿ ಸ್ನೇಹಿತರೆ ಆ ಇವತ್ತೇನಿತ್ ತಗೊಂಡಿದ್ದಲ್ಲ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ಸೆಷನ್ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಜೀವನದ ಕೊನೆ ತನಕ ಯಾಕಂದ್ರೆ ಒಂದ್ ಜಾಬ್ ಇಟ್ ಮತ್ತೊಂದ್ ಜಾಬ್ ಹೋಗ್ಬೇಕಂದ್ರೆ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅ ರೆಸ್ಯೂಮ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಆಡ್ ಅ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಟು ಯು ಸೊ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ನೊಂದು ಹೇಳಬೇಕಂದ್ರೆ ಪ್ರಜ್ವಲ್ ಸರ್ ಹೇಳಿದ್ ರೈಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಟು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅ ಗುಡ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜ್ ವಿಚ್ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾವು Uh, we all been taking many sessions tagonti vela maartivi ivaga for example nanu english barutte athwa kannada barutte nanage tamil bar tamil barala tamil andre maatartini telugu antu maatadakku agala but adanna kashta patti nanu prayatna padadu important maadidre ella ketogutte so whichever language you know adanna chanaga maatadi 
ಕನ್ನಡ ಗೊತ್ತಿದ್ರೆ ದಯವಿಟ್ಟು ಕನ್ನಡದಲ್ಲೇ ಮಾತಾಡಿ ವೆರಿ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಹಿಂದಿ ಗೊತ್ತಿದ್ರೆ ಹಿಂದಿ ಮಾತಾಡಿ ಬೇರೆ ಯಾವ್ದು ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜ್ ಇದೆ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿದೆ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳಿ ಯಾರ ಹತ್ರ ಮಾತಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ರ ಅವನು ಅರ್ಥ ಮಾಡ್ಕೋಬೇಕು ಅಷ್ಟೆ ಅವನು ಅರ್ಥ ಆಯ್ತು ಅಂದ್ರೆ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಎಫೆಕ್ಟಿವ್ ಕಮ್ಯುನಿಕೇಶನ್ ಸ್ಕಿಲ್ ಜೆಸ್ಟರ್ಸ್ ಅಂತೀವಲ್ಲ ಬಾಡಿ ಮೂವ್ ಬಾಡಿ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜ್ ಅಂತೀವಿ ನಾನ್ ವರ್ಬಲ್ ಸ್ಪೀಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಮಾತಾಡೋದು ಇಲ್ಲ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಬರೀ ಮೂ ಮೂಗ್ ಪ್ರಾಣಿ ಆದ ತಕ್ಷಣ ನಾವು ಕೈಯಿಂದ ಮೂ ಮೂವ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಹೇಳ್ತೀವಲ್ಲ ಅದು ಕೂಡ ಒನ್ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಮ್ಯುನಿಕೇಶನ್ ಬಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಗಿವ್ ಅ ಗುಡ್ ಕಮ್ಯುನಿಕೇಶನ್ ಬೈ ಯೂಸಿಂಗ್ ದೋಸ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ರಿಯಲಿ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ ಯು ಟು ಮೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಮಚ್ ಬೆಟರ್ ಇನ್ನೊಂದು ಹೇಳ್ಬೇಕಂತಿದ್ದೀನಿ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಟು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಬೆಂಗಳೂರಲ್ಲಿ ಜೆ ಸಿ ಎ ಬ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಲೂರ್ ಗಾರ್ಡನ್ ಸಿಟಿ ಹಿಂದಿನ ಮೂರು ವರ್ಷದಿಂದ ಒಂದು ಪ್ರಗತಿ ಅಂತ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೀವಿ ಪ್ರಗತಿ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಯಾವ ರೀತಿ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಒಂದು ಕಾಲೇಜನ್ನ ಅಡಾಪ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂತೀವಿ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ವಿ ಹಾವ್ ಅಡಾಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ವಿಜಯ ಕಾಲೇಜ್ ಅಟ್ ಪಿ ಯು ಕಾಲೇಜ್ ಅಟ್ ಜಯನಗರ್ ಜಯನಗರ್ ಇದ್ದ ಕಾಲೇಜ್ ಅನ್ನ ಅಡಾಪ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡಿದೀವಿ ಆ ಕಾಲೇಜ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಒಂದು ಫಸ್ಟ್ ನಾವು ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಓರಿಯೆಂಟೇಶನ್ ತಗೊಂತೀವಿ ಓರಿಯೆಂಟೇಶನ್ ಏನ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀವಿ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಅರ್ಥ ಮಾಡಿಸ್ತೀವಿ ಈ ಪ್ರಗತಿ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಏನಿದೆ ಅಂತ ಪ್ರಗತಿ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ವಿ ಗಿವ್ ಅ ರೆಗ್ರೆಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಾಫ್ ಮಂತ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಟು ದಿಸ್ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕಾಲೇಜ್ ವೇರ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ರೆಡಿ ಟು ಲರ್ನ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಡೇ ಟು ಅವರ್ ಸಾಫ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಕಿಲ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಟೆಕ್ನಿಕಲ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಸ್ಕಿಲ್ ಡೆವಲಪ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಎವರ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಬಿ ಟ್ಯಾಲಿ ಆರ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಶೀಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಎವರ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಟು ಅವರ್ಸ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಡೇ ಫಾರ್ ಒನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಾಫ್ ಮಂತ್ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂಸ್ಲಿ ಪೋಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಾಫ್ ಮಂತ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಅ ಜಾಬ್ ಮೇಲ ವೇರ್ ದೀಸ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ರಿಕ್ರೂಟೆಡ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಕಂಪ್ನಿ ಆ ಜಾಬ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಕಡೆಯಿಂದ ಕಂಪ್ನಿಯವನ್ನ ಕರಿತೀವಿ ಅಲ್ಲೇ ಇಂಟರ್ವ್ಯೂ ಪ್ರೋಸೆಸ್ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಆ ಇಂಟರ್ವ್ಯೂ ಪ್ರೋಸೆಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಅವರಿಗೆ ರಿಕ್ರೂಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಕಾಲೇಜ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಅಂತಿವಲ್ಲ ಅಥವಾ ಕಾಲೇಜ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಕೊಡ್ತೀವಿ ಸೊ ಈ ವರ್ಷ ನಾವು ಮಾಡಿದ್ವಿ ಅಪ್ರಾಕ್ಸಿಮೇಟ್ಲಿ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ ಪಾರ್ಟಿಸಿಪೇಟೆಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸೆವೆಂಟಿ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಬೀನ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ರಿಕ್ರೂಟೆಡ್ ಬೈ ದ ಕಂಪ್ನೀಸ್ ಆನ್ ದಿ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಸೊ ಒಂದ್ ಬಿಗ್ ಅಚೀವ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಇದೆ ಅಂತ ಅಟ್ಲೀಸ್ಟ್ ಸಮ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಲೈಫ್ ಆರ್ ಬೀನ್ ಸೆಟಲ್ಡ್ ಒಂದ್ ಮಂತ್ಸ್ ಇದೆ ನಾನು ಕಾಲೇಜ್ ಮುಗಿದ ತಕ್ಷಣನೇ ನಾನು ಅಟ್ಲೀಸ್ಟ್ ನನ್ನ ಕೆಲಸ ಕೈಯಲ್ಲಿದೆ ಸೊ ಅದು ಒಂದು ತುಂಬಾ ಖುಷಿ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಸೊ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಟ್ರೈಂಗ್ ಟು ಡೂ ದಿಸ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಡನ್ ಇನ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ವೇರ್ ಯು ಪೀಪಲ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಇಮಿಡಿಯೇಟ್ಲಿ ಸೊ ಇಫ್ ದ ಇನಿಷಿಯೇಟಿವ್ ಟೇಕನ್ ಬೈ ಎನಿಬಡಿ ಲೆಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಬಿ ಜೆ ಸಿಸ್ ಆರ್ ಎನಿ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಟೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಫ್ ದೇ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಮೇಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಇನ್ ಅ ಬಿಗರ್ ವೇ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಅ ಡ್ರೈವ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಅ ವೆರಿ ಸಸ್ಟೈನಬಲ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ವೇರ್ ಅ ಪರ್ಸನ್ಸ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಇಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ಚೇಂಜ್ ಐ ಯು ಐ ಆಮ್ ರಿಯಲಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ದಟ್ ವೆರಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ದಟ್ ವೆನ್ ಐ ಟೇಕ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಮೈ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ i am not looking for any kind of a good in my own professions where i am into we have started a company called professio where we are taking trainings professionally uh, paid basis we are taking uh, we am doing my business i am doing my retail counters i am looking after my interiors design projects as well as architectural projects so adanella nodkonta idini adanna maad takshanalu kuda nu onde manasal aasakti idde devaru ella kottidare but one life na change madidre one life na guri avaru change madidre obba life na mele bandre saaku ivattinda 20 25 jana nan maat ivatt maat kelidira nanna ನಾನು ನಿಮ್ಮನ್ನ ನೆನಪು ಮಾಡಲ್ಲ ಬೈ ಬೈ ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ಐ 
friends due to technical connection i don't not able to play that video fine that's okay but only thing is inspiration to be given that uh, life is nothing to uh, lose or anything uh, life alli yavade karanakku namma onde aasakti idkobeku we can do anything in our life and we can achieve lot of things never have a giving a, never have a attitude of giving up because uh, giving up is always a person who is always want to lose because i don't think so anyone can lose in their life everyone has their own qualities everyone has their own power everyone can do something special in their life let it be any kind of a field and you can make wonders in your life success is not just money but success is lot of things in your life understand one more thing life is made for beautiful things to be done and enjoy your life to the core and uh, heartfelt gratitude to jc prajwal and the lom uh, jci bilal kopa for giving me an opportunity for taking this wonderful session to make you guys and getting interacted to so many of you guys uh, and making uh, if i come to bilal kopa i'll surely meet you guys uh, nearby any place like mudigeri or any i, I do travel to many of the places poor or mudigeri or just kind of place if i come across to bilal kopa at that moment i really meet you guys and have a great time enjoy uh, achieve lot of things in your life make your life more simple because life is to achieve lot of things and never to give up so do not try to have any kind of a attitude that i cannot do anything yes we can do something and we can we will do anything in our life and we'll achieve our success to the largest extent over to prajwal sir uh, thank you very much for giving opportunity sir uh, thanks to you sir yakandre nanige thumba aase ittu hitesh sir na karisbeku anta training ige ड्यू टू के कारण सेशन केलो आगे बट दिस वाज द पर्फेक्ट थिंग नन करियाकाश सिम वेरी हापी आक्चुअली तुम्बा वे वि हाड वंटे नम्स से अन्सते तुम्बा वाले से तक नानू तुम कलते अंतनी स्पेषली पार्टिसपेन्स उपकार आगे नमी अद्रद्रिंत बेरे खुशी आक्चुअली कमेंट बंद खुशी आयत सर कंडक्ट दिस इन अवर कॉलेज टू अंत सो दिस वाट वि एक्सपेक्ट स्टूडेंट ट्रेनिंग मत कंपवर दम से निम्ल जीवन बदलवे नानी अथवा हितेश सर गली अथवा संजय अद्रिंत बेरे ना क so we want you to you know grow in a in a larger manner anta helta sir it was a very wonderful session uh, hope uh, innu now future uh, collaborate maadkondu ond olle training galna maadabodu anta ankonta uh, over to jc sushant for uh, vote of thanks good evening everyone जेसे बेलाकोपा जेसे ज्ञान सौहार्द जयपुर इवर आयोजित फ्यूचर ट्रेनिंग सीरियस दिन वाद रेस्यूम एंड इंटरव्यू एम तरबे यशस्वी यह तरबे यशस्सू मूल कारणीकर्तर जेसी ए बेलाकोप अध्यक्षर जेसी प्रज्वल जैन जेसी ए ज्ञान सौहार्द जयपुर अध्यक्षर जेसी संजय आर् इवर के वंदने तरबे नडसिक रेस्यूम इंटरव्यू जो गोल से बू सह नाशनल ट्रेनर आद जे एफ एम हितेश गिरी सर इवे नम निल परवा हृत्पूर्वक धन्यवाद नम फ्यूचर ट्रेनिंग सीरियस प्रोत्साह सहक जेसी बेलाकोपू जेसी ज्ञान सौहार्द जयपुर निकटपूर्व अध्यक्ष सदस्य पूर्वाध्यक्ष नम तू वंदने तरबे भागवी यशस्वीगू धन्यवाद अर्पन अगेन थैंक यू वेरी मच हित सर रियली रिवर्स इंजीनियरी आर ट्रेनिंग से कंटिन्यूरियर गईडेन्सियर बेवत निम्हे के अंत ना तोर्सको जॉब न हेगे तक अंत एंड ना अद्भुत वाद ट्रेनर नम वाद पूर्वाध्यक्ष जेसे सैनेटर जयचंदर अंत और स्टडी टेक्निक ना कल बेदी आम जीवन मुख्यवा बेहद उत्तम हेगे ओदबूद अंत ओद बंदा अब बरी रैंक तक अथवा स्कोर सीमित अंदर अल अः अर्थ मक ओद तुम्बा मुख्यवा अद्र बे ना हे एफेक्टिव आगे ओदबूद हे टाइम न तुम्बा चेना उपयोगक ओदबूद अंत स्टडी टेक्निक बेहतर ट्रेनिंग मा के जे सी एस सैनेटर जयचंदर डाक्टर जयचंदर अः ना निगे से तक अः वि वि इनफार्म यू इन अवर् ग्रूप अंड थैंक यू एवरी वन फॉर्वर पार्टिसपेशन थैंक यू हितेश सर Thank you sir thank you very much